I'll tell you another sign, another red flag for depression that I missed. I should have known something was wrong. The zero key fell off my laptop and I didn't do anything about it for two years. That's too long. That's too long to wait. I, try, I went down to the Apple store and I was like, can I get a new zero? And they were like, oh, you have to buy a whole new keyboard. It costs $200. And I was like, well, I'm not worth it. And I left. <laughs> do you ever do this thing where something of yours breaks and you're like, okay, I can pay to fix this or I can make my life a little shittier every day. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I did, I did the latter. And I had a whole system, I had a workaround. Every time I needed a zero, I would go to Google and I would type in the name of my favorite rapper as much as I could. I would type in Andre 3 and then wait for it to autocomplete thousand and then I'd copy paste one of his zeros into whatever I was working on. And I did that every day for two years. No one in this room has Googled Andre 3000 more than me. None of you have. I've Googled him more than he has, you know? It got weird. I realized, I was like, oh man, if Andre ever goes missing, I am suspect number one. There's no way the NSA is gonna look at that and be like, this woman Googled Andre 3000 seven or eight times a day, every day, and clicked on nothing. Case closed. This is too weird. So. I finally, I finally went down to the Apple store and I got, a, I got a new keyboard. I have a zero. I can type it whenever I want. <laughs> but there's still this little voice in my head every time I do, every time I type a zero, it goes, you didn't earn it. <laughs> I don't know, I feel, I feel very grateful to Andre 3000. That's, that's how I feel now. I just, he's lent me so many zeros over the years. I just feel like if I ever meet him, I just want to be like, you may be called Andre 3000, but you're Andre 3 billion to me, buddy. <laughs> I just want him to know. I just want him to know he's special.